My name is Raja Chandran and I founded Galaxy Tech Solution. I have never found research and business to be incompatible with each other. In fact, I find they go hand in hand. These are my thoughts for research-driven entrepreneurship. Most researchers have had the training in identifying knowledge gaps and problems that need to be solved. And they can conduct extensive and systematic literature reviews to identify works that has been done, knowledge that has been generated that could solve these problems. In an academic environment, what follows is the development of a research proposal which would bridge the knowledge gap or solve the problem that you identified. In a business situation, this would be the preparation of a business plan to complete your project. Writing business proposals may not be so alien to researchers because in an academic environment, researchers are required to develop research proposals to obtain funding for their research. Just as you may uh, be pitching in your business idea to a potential investor. Firstly, you need to define your ideas. Whatever you choose, it needs to be something you deeply believe in because only then will you do whatever it takes to make it work. You need to protect your ideas. Consult the right people about registering for a trademark or a patent for your idea or product. You need to read and develop yourself. Find the information that you need to help you decide whether your idea is worth pursuing. Do your market research. Educate yourself well on business. Develop skills that you might be lacking. Learn about entrepreneurship, business strategy, fundraising, intellectual property, and more. These can be done through online classes and webinars. You need to be consistent. In the beginning, you may have to do everything yourself, from market research, web design, advertising, marketing, and even production. Do your sampling and test rigorously. You need to make sure that your products and services are well thought out, well tested. So continue testing them and sampling them rigorously. If it's one thing we can take from research to business, it's how we learn from failures. We need to train ourselves to stay motivated despite the failures. The same applies for research. We need to be patient and we need to learn from our mistakes. Develop a strong and healthy network. Create a support system of mentors, collaborators and peers that are willing to help others. Connect with motivated people who believe in your mission. Furthermore, you may hire experts to help you so that you can free your time and do developmental items. Advertise, put yourself out there, develop your brand regularly, share your work with the world using different platforms. Use the web, social network, give talks, use social media and write blogs. You're already familiar with the publish or perish from academic, so you need to apply this into your business. Be competitive. As hard as you worked to publish your research quickly and stay ahead of the competition, the same applies to business. Nobody plays fair in business. Do not delay. Get your product, get your ideas and get them out there before someone else does. So create a successful business plan, follow your business plan and review it regularly. You may need to modify it as you go along. Finally, 
I would say that there's no better training to be a businessman than to stay in business. And now is always the best time to get started. Good luck.